The Dell 179710 is a large, elegant and powerful 17-inch laptop which comes with Intel's 11th generation Tiger Lake processors and Nvidia's GeForce RTX 30 series GPUs. The Dell XPS 17 offers excellent power on the multitasking and gaming front, with great audio and a comfortable keyboard, but with a not-so-great battery. Now let's take a look at the pros and cons of the Dell 17. Pros Number 1. Bright and amazing screen Number 2. Elegant build and design Number 3. Impressive performance Number 4. Ultra-thin bezels Number 5. Good keyboard and touchpad Cons Number 1. Mediocre battery life Number 2. Poor webcam now let's take an in-depth look at the major components that makes up the Dell 17, like the design, ports, keyboard and touchpad, performance, display and speakers, and battery life. The Dell 17 comes with great materials like heat milled aluminum, corning gorilla glass, and carbon fiber. The display lid and base are silver, with a prominent Dell logo. The Dell XPS 17 has a 94% screen-to-body ratio, which means the black borders surrounding the display are hardly noticeable. Weighing 5.3 pounds and measuring 14.7 times 9.8 times 0.8 inches, the XPS 17 is a large laptop, to say the least. Now to number 2, the ports. The Dell XPS 17 keeps its ports simple, it comes with for Thunderbolt, 4 ports and a full-sized SD card slot. These ports tell you a lot about who the XPS 17 primarily is for, there are no HDMI port. Fortunately, Dell tosses in a USB-C adapter with both US Type-A and HDMI, for free. The full-size SD card slot is provided for the photographers and videographers. The Dell XPS 17 has a great keyboard and touchpad. The key presses are springy and don't feature any tomfoolery around low travel nonsense. Typing is quiet and comfortable. Another profound thing about the keyboard is how large the keycaps are, leaving very little empty space in between keys, and nice wide keys on the SIDs. The touchpad is similarly wide, this touchpad is designed specifically to make use of the 17-inch form factor. Tracking is precise, and the click is nice and quiet. Number 4. The Performance of the Dell XPS 17 What you get in the Dell XPS 17 base model is the Intel Core i5-11 for UOH, integrated Intel UHD graphics, 8GB of RAM, and a 512GB SSD, but it doesn't lean on the strengths of the XPS 17. When you update cores and adding in a discrete graphics card, the Dell XPS 17 becomes a much more capable performer. It comes with the Core i7-1180H, 16GB of RAM, NVIDIA RTX 3060. With all this you'll get a laptop that excels in heavy tasks such as creative application performance and gaming. The Dell XPS 17 is already a powerful laptop, but the bump to RTX 30 series graphics crank up the performance. It's easy to see the benefits when comparing 3D Mark score, where the newer model is 18% faster in the same test. You might write off the RTX 3060 compared to the 3070 or 3080 featured in gaming laptops. This system can deliver 70 watts of power to the graphics card, which is more than what many non-gaming laptops can do. That results in faster frame rates in the games tested so, outside of the heaviest games, the XPS 17 can hit over 60 frames per second in games at 1920 times 1200 The 60Hz refresh rate is a big limitation on how enjoyable the gaming experience will be. For that reason, it's not a laptop that should be purchased primarily for the purpose of gaming. The improved graphics, as well as better performance in creative applications. I tested the laptop's video editing capabilities in Puget Bench Premiere Pro Benchmark. Run tests from 4000 video paybacks. 
The processor performance is also extremely important in these tests, and the 11th Gen Intel Core i7-11800H at the heart of the XPS 17 performs admirably. The CPU hummed along at around 3.2 GHz, occasionally boosting up to 4.19 GHz. Its Mark 10 scores were fantastic, which tests daily tasks like web browsing, video conferencing, and spreadsheets. Most of the impressive performance of the XPS 17 comes from its good thermals. Surface temperatures never get too hot, and internal temperatures stay fairly cool. Although sometimes it jumps up to the max of 100 degrees Celsius for both the GPU and CPU, the temperatures primarily stayed under 70 degrees during the majority of the testing. Number 5. Display and Speakers the Dell XPS 17 is all about its screen. The 17-inch screen is in the 16-10 aspect ratio, which is perfect for the size of laptop. The resolution is 3840 x 2400, which is even more pixels than a standard 4000 screen. The result is a superbly crisp display with touch capabilities. The base model of the Dell XPS 17 is a 1920X1200 model, and it doesn't come with a touch screen. The high-resolution screen is made with creatives in mind. It's a bright and colorful screen with nearly perfect color saturation, hitting 100% in shirt and 98% in Adobe Color SBA scenes. Color accuracy is on point too and max brightness was measured at 491 nits. It's a bright, gorgeous screen through and through. The speakers are decent. For a laptop of this size, I was hoping to hear more bass, but the XPS 17 does feature a nice stereo image and can get quite loud without crackles. If you're wanting to listen to some background music or podcasts while working, these speakers should do the trick without too many complaints. The 720p webcam which is situated in the bezel above the display, is terrible. It's part of the trade-off with having such a narrow top bezel. Number 6. Battery Life The battery life on the Dell XPS 17 isn't great. Dell packed in a 97-watt-hour battery inside you can't safely pack in a battery much larger. You shouldn't expect all-day battery life. The combination of the large, high-resolution screen, 45-watt CPU, and RTX graphics are all power suckers, and it shows through how long the battery lasts. In the light web browsing test, the laptop lasted just over 5 hours. It fared much better during video playback, where it lasted almost 10 and a half hours and while looping a 1080p movie trailer. The 1080p model without RTX graphics will likely last longer, the XPS 15 will also net you a couple more hours of battery life. The Dell XPS 17 is in a class of its own. The XPS 17 might be for you if you need a big screen and good performance laptop. The closest real alternative to the Dell 17 is the Razer Blade 17. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions do leave them in the comment section below. If you desire to check out the Dell XPS 17 there is a link in the description below. Please support.